All right, what's up, everybody? Thank you for tuning in real quick with Chef Stu, giving you guys some behind the scenes with the seasoning tips that come with the spice blend. Now, if you received your spice blend, then you got these tips. If not, you need to order you some spice blend so that you can follow my lead. First thing that I ask for you guys to do in the comfort of your own home is to basically rinse off your protein, get you a nice little kitchen towel like so, and then we're gonna come back over and we're gonna pat dry. Now this is really important. Number one, rinsing the meat off is kind of good to help you get rid of all the extra blood, all the extra stuff that came on it. Rinse that right on the way. But more importantly, water sometimes can mess up the spice blend because it'll kind of rinse off the seasoning that you put on there. So we want to make sure that we get a nice consistent marinade on the pork ribs. So we just want to come back through with a nice kitchen towel and you should end up with something that looks like so. Quick little suggestion with your ribs. You might just want to go around with a knife, clean up some of that extra fat, get rid of that. Leave a little bit on there because it's in flavor, but for the most part, you just don't want super big. I've already came through, cleaned up that, and I removed that backside. I suggest you guys do the same thing. Every now and then, I like to just put a couple little lines in my ribs just to open them up like so. I suggest you do the same. Nice little diamonds. That actually helps the meat get in, help the seasoning get into the meat as well. All right, so the next step after that was put a little light olive oil. All right, you just wanna come through. Look at that, look at that. All right, I'm gonna flip it over. I'm gonna come back on, a little more olive oil. I'm actually gonna give y'all a bonus trick in today's clip. Not only am I showing you guys how to kind of use the spice blend, but then I wanna give you a real quick trip on how to make ribs fall off the bone from the comfort of your own home. All right, and you already know what it is, that signature stew stick seasoning. And we just gonna come back through. All right, and we gonna get close, get close for them. Get close for them. Get close for them. I want y'all to smell it. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. All right, so on the spice tips, I suggested that you guys let this marinate from six to 24 hours. So with the power of television, I'm showing you how to do it. But I already got a set of ribs that been going for the last six hours. And that's what you're looking for, nice evenly coat. Then stand it up, flip it back over, and let's do our backside the same exact way. All right, so if you don't know how to get the Spice Blend, it's actually available on Etsy, Amazon, and you also can get it on Shopify now. If not, you could always email chefstewsticks at gmail.com and we'll make sure that we get you your order out. For those of you guys who already purchased the Spice, I appreciate the testimonials. Please keep them coming because when people see that you guys got the Spice Blend, then they want to get some too. Now here goes the trick. Take your reds. Sit them in like so. I'll move that back so you guys can see. You just want to fold it over like so. Tuck them in. Same exact thing on the other side. All right, let me move this real quick. Get this out the way. And we'll come back with another piece of foil. Turn that side over this time. And if you can, have that meat in the middle. Fold it over. And then it's the end. Just kind of want to tuck it. Same thing, like so. Y'all might want to measure y'all for a little bit better. Preheat the oven. Now, I'm going to leave this. In this marinade, stick it in the refrigerator, let it go for six to 24 hours. Once it's complete, I'll put it on a half a sheet pan like so. I'm gonna stick it in the oven and I'll be coming back to you guys soon with the finished product. I appreciate your support. Hope to see you soon. Get yourself some spice and tell me if it made a difference in your life. Have a good day, guys.